What's up guys, it's your boy Sarar, and welcome to the Fortnite Fishing Challenge. Now, the last time I tried this was a very long time ago. I think it was almost a year ago since I've done this challenge. But honestly, it's a really cool challenge. It's a very simple concept. Just win a game of Fortnite only using items that I get from fishing spots. Last time I tried this, I got a couple top fives, nothing too crazy. Let's try and actually get a win today. Now, if you guys did not know, I actually did recently move, so all of my new content is gonna be coming out of this room that you're seeing right here. It is gonna be both gaming and fishing content, and I have a lot of new content on the way, so please stay tuned for that. So the last time I tried this challenge, I found that this area over here by the statue was my best bet for actually getting some good loot because there's a lot of fishing spots around there and it's typically not highly contested so i think that's going to be a really good spot for us to go to today all right we should have a pretty solid drop we can land on a couple of these barrels see if we can get a harpoon so as i said the rules are pretty simple just get a win off of only fishing spots the only real rule to this is i cannot pick up anything but ammo or farm materials in this challenge everything else has to come from fishing spots now the problem i ran into last time i did this challenge was not the heels i had plenty of heels the problem really was getting weapons or at least half decent weapons that i could actually use oh finally so at least We've got a shotgun now. So this is definitely a bit rougher than I was hoping it would be. All right, there we go. An SMG. That is perfect. A couple guys fighting on top here. Alright. That kill got stolen, but I don't think this guy knows where I am. This guy's fully boxed. I'm gonna just yoink some of this loot really quick. Hopefully get the builds as well. And this kid's cranking up to height. There is no point in me taking this fight anymore. Not from range, that's for sure. I may or may not be trolling. Let's get out of here. I need to mat up because I have a feeling I'm going to just need to build battle my way through the end. Let's see if I can beam this kid. There we go. I'll take it. Ooh. I have height on this kid, which is nice. Kinda have height on this whole lobby. If I had a sniper right now, this would be perfect. 
But I am in zone top six on height, but I only have an SMG to aim with. Oi. He knows about me. Guy flying in too. They're gonna build battle. This thing can't be on much. That kid's dead. Thank you. How does that kid not die though? Alright, I guess I'm fighting this kid now. I don't think there's anybody behind me. I think it's just this kid. I can let this kid pass. I can beam him on his way out. Because he's probably going to be fighting the kid in the box. The kid on height over here, too. He's challenging height, and then there's a kid on this side, right? Or did that kid get sniped? Oh God, fun. I gotta play this really weird from, like, ulti low. Kid on ultimate high is my problem right now. I need to hope this kid hits the god snipe of his career right now. What did I get? I don't have a lot of mats for this either. I'm kind of in a bad spot. I'm out of mats, dude. It would end in water, wouldn't it? GG. I should have just held my gun out. There was no reason for that. Uh, GG's.
Uh, second place, man. Second place. Not bad for having, like, no guns the entire game. Well, guys, that was episode two of the Fortnite Fishing Challenge. We did get a top two and just lost in the end because we had no mats. So that's a little bit unfortunate, but overall, it was fun to get back into Fortnite a bit and just fun to get back into the Fortnite Fishing Challenge with Chapter 4 Inbound. So I am super excited for that. Be on the lookout for more Fortnite content and sub to the channel for more content in general. And as always, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.